Oh my... What the... F uh... What the hell? I already shocked. ChatGPT has been taken over the World Wide Web by a storm since it has been out there. I have not touched it. Like, hands off. I don't necessarily jump into bandwagon. I try to sort of listen to what other people say first before going into it. And I think that today is the perfect day to go and make a blind review for ChatGPT. Hey there, what's up you guys? My name is Emmy Bernice. I make videos about videos, freelancing, and digital marketing. And today, we're going to be going into my computer and let's see if ChatGPT is going to be able to write an email for me. And I don't really know the rules. I haven't read them. I just found a couple of videos that say that if you want ChatGPT to give you really, really, really good or awesome results, you have to be very, very specific about it. And I tried not to although i'm really in a huge help of writing email <laughs> we have email writers in the team but for some reason i don't like writing it but at the same time it's part of this whole marketing thing in my business that i don't want other people to get a hold of or it's like i'm having a hard time of letting it go so let's try if chat gpd can do that work for me and so, without further ado, let us dive right in. Okay, here we go. I'm going to put on my glasses because I can't really see from afar. And there you go. Your nerdy girl is back. So this is the first time that I'm in. And I just made like a really quick sign up via Google. And it's in a dark theme. Wow. So it has your examples, capabilities, and limitations. Examples explain quantum computing in simple terms. Capabilities remembers what user said earlier in the conversation. May occasionally generate incorrect information. May occasionally produce harmful instructions or biased content. Limited knowledge of world and events after 20... Oh, okay. So it has a couple of knowledge or historical stuff that has been uploaded, but only after 2021. Mm. How do I make an HTTP request in JavaScript? Train to decline inappropriate requests. Ooh, okay. So let's try having ChatGPT create an email for me for my mini course, Skyrocket in Freelancing. So I typed in, write an email about Skyrocket in Freelancing and Demi Bernice's point of view. I don't know if ChatGPT actually knows me. I don't know. It's a four part mini course that will help you get your foot at the freelancing industry in four days. This is for people that are A, having a hard time starting their freelancing journey or B, for people who have started it but cannot seem to have their breakthrough in freelancing. You can get access of it by enrolling and settling a $10 payment. You'll also get a 50% discount to Demi Bernice's course, Great and Rise Academy, if you enroll to Skyrocket in freelancing as an awesome bonus. This is, oh my God. Let's see what ChatGPT is gonna say. Okay, it's typing, typing, typing. Okay, so while ChatGPT is generating the awesome email, and I already saw that this kid wrote a subject line. That's pretty awesome because it was very specific that it was an email. So let's just dance here. Oh my, what the? F what the? Hell, I already shocked. This is f***ing ridiculous. So let's read what chat GPT is created. Subject, skyrocket your freelancing journey in just four days. What the hell? This is like my headline for almost all of my ads, but not really like skyrocket your freelancing, but start your freelancing journey in just four days. Like that is the headline of almost all of my Facebook ads. It says, hi there, are you struggling to make your mark in the freelancing industry? Do you find it hard to start your freelancing journey or get a breakthrough? If yes, then I have some good news for you. I am excited to share with you my four part mini course, Skyrocket and Freelancing. This course is designed to help you get your foot in the freelancing industry in just four days. Whether you're a beginner or an experienced freelancer, this sounds exactly like me. This course will help you get the success you deserve. The course is divided into four parts. 
Each part is designed to help you achieve a specific goal in your freelancing journey. The four parts are as follows. Finding your niche, creating an outstanding profile, winning your first project, building your reputation, and getting repeat clients. That is so weird because the part one really is finding your niche. The second one is creating an outstanding profile. I think that's part of it, but it was really, I don't even know. Like, how does this kid know that there are four parts. Well, I said there's four days. I don't know, like how does this person, like does this AI thing look into Google and shit? <laughs> I don't even know. <laughs> oh my God, this is like a really good Eureka moment. Anyway. So it says finding your niche, creating an outstanding profile, winning your first project, building your reputation and getting repeat clients. So I think it is creating an outstanding profile. And then the third one is about paid test runs, which I have discussed in lesson three, and then build your reputation and getting repeat clients. It's the only part that I don't think this AI got. So one point for me. <laughs> By the end of this course, you will have a clear understanding of how to find your niche, creating an outstanding profile, win your first project, and build your reputation as a freelancer. You will be well on your way to becoming a successful freelancer. Oh, we're, we're repetitive. Like, I don't like how there's like freelancer here and then another freelancer there. Like, anyway. So to enroll in this course, two points for me, by the way. <laughs> All you need to do is settle a $10 payment. And as a bonus, you'll get a 50% discount to my course, Great Ross Academy. This course is designed to help you take your freelance. Oh my God. And with the bonus, you can access it for half the price. What? Well, how did T know? How did, like, how did chat GPT understand that that is what I was intending to do? Like that really is the reason why we have it at a 50% discount. It's because I really wanted for other people to sort of like, if they decide to take their freelancing journey to the next level, Crate and Rise Academy is there at a 50% bonus because it will help them take their freelancing journey to the next level. Like, how did ChatGPT know that? That is so creepy. So what are you waiting for? Don't let your freelancing journey be a struggle. Enroll in Skyrock in freelancing today and start your journey to success. What the fuck? That is crazy. Ha okay, so this looks more of like, I wouldn't write my email like this if it's like a launch email. This looks more of like, an ad copy. So uh, let's see, can I edit? Okay. So write an ad copy. Let's see how's that going to go. Save and submit. Okay. Now it's doing its thing again with just creating an ad copy. That is so weird. Chat GPT actually understands how things are going in the marketing industry or it took data because i wouldn't understand if chat gpt took data from google because skyrocket in freelancing is just there it's seo enabled and you know you get that information but to know exactly why we placed create and rise academy at a 50 percent discount on a back end to help other people take their freelancing journey to the next level like that is the weirdest bit. And sometimes it also sounds like me. So this is weird. <laughs> okay. So now it's doing an ad copy. Hey there, Sammy Bernice, are you having a hard time? Uh, or maybe you've already started, but you can't seem to catch a break and get your career off the ground. Ooh. If so, I have some great news for you. I've created a four part mini course called Skyrock Air Freelancing that will help you get your foot in the door of freelancing in just four days. This course is perfect for anyone who wants to start freelancing, but doesn't know where to begin or those who have already started, but are struggling to make progress. ChatGBT writes better ads than me. And the best part, you can get access to Skyrocket and freelancing for just $10. Plus is an awesome bonus. If you enroll in Skyrocket and freelancing, you'll also get a 50% discount on my Create and Rise Academy course. So don't wait any longer. Enroll in Skyrocket and freelancing today and take the first step towards a successful career. Uh, that is so weird. So what is my conclusion after going through the entirety of ChatGPT? I think that it is awesome. It's a good tool to expedite your process if you're a copywriter or a marketer, but I think it's good to note 
that as a conclusion, I realized that as of this moment, I don't know how awesome it's going to go because nothing is absolute. Everything is changing. I think that they're still going to be improving the software and it's already awesome from here on forward. So I don't know how awesome it's, uh, how awesomer it's going to be in the next couple of years. It's a really good tool. What I'm concerned of is that it cannot, as of this moment, it cannot be an assurance that there's going to be conversion and effectivity in terms of creating emails or ads or whatever that is in chat GPT. If it's a blog post, the feature rating, some things that do not really need to be converted, I think that it's okay. It aids with the process. It expedites the process, this whole thing. If you're running out of creative juice is what other writers would term it. I think that it's awesome. Like you can have chat GPT fill in the gaps that you cannot fill as of that moment. That would only mean that you don't need to procrastinate in writing anymore because there is the software that can help fill in the gaps that you cannot as of that moment. But if you're a marketer or you're a copywriter and you understand the basic concept of copywriting and ad writing is that there should be a really clear tug of war between value and cost that would increase the probability of acceptance by the person who reads it. Okay. So does that make any sense? I hope that was clear. So there should be a perfect balance or a perfect tug of war between value and cost in order to increase the acceptability of the person who reads it. Okay. So when you understand that formula as a copywriter and you enter that into chat GPT, then that would be awesome, right? So what am I trying to say here? Whatever you have or the information that the person who uses chat GPT feeds into the software, that's the only thing that chat GPT would be able to improve on, right? So the more detailed you are, the more knowledgeable you are with the subject matter that you have, then chat GPT can improve it. But what if you're a copywriter or you're an, you're an ad writer and your information about the subject matter is just this small? And so you feed it into chat GPT thinking that it's an assurance that your copy or your ad is going to be awesome. Well, that's where you're going to fall apart. So I think that's a really valuable conclusion right there. If you want chat GPT to be able to aid you when, well, then you have to go back to the books. So you have to read more and research further in order for you to know your subject, like at the back of your hand, right? So I think that at the end of the day, the software is still a follower. So we feed what we have in our brains and it's a good tool to expedite the process, but don't rely on it in terms of conversion. You still have to understand and write your very own ad copy or improve from whatever chat GPT has given you. Okay. So if you're a person who looks into that software to have your writing improved on, you can take what ChatGPT delivers and then improve from it also so that it would be a really good working relationship. It's, it's like having two brains into a one project and then, you know, passing the information back and forth until you're able to come up with a really good project that you're going to put out there to the world that you could be proud of. Okay, so there you have it. That is my blind review about ChatGPT. Super awesome software, whoever made it. You got brains. Awesome, awesome work. Congratulations. And I hope that you also get the chance to get into ChatGPT, see how it's going to improve your work as a marketer, see how it's going to expedite the process of the things that you want expedited. And yeah, there you have it. If you like that video, make sure to like and subscribe. And if you want marketing and tips, anything about freelancing, if that's your cup of tea, this channel is for you. And I publish videos every Wednesdays. We have been consistent for a while, so that's awesome. And that's it. I'll see you in the next one.